A moment to celebrate for Wala Gasmi. Youths Decide celebrates its third anniversary. The organization helps young Tunisians find their way in the world. Amid austerity measures, unemployment is on the rise. Wala and her team stepped in offering free digital training skills to the poor across the country. We used Facebook, we used social media, we used the photos, the video. Uh, everyone was able to, uh, to create, to produce uh, information and to share it on social media. And this is how uh, we came together to uh, kick Ben Ali out. And this is how we want to come together uh, to build our country and to be uh, an example. Nihal has recently graduated from university. She says joining Youths Decide has changed her life. I feel now that I have purpose in life. The projects we offer the youth are interesting. Our aim is to build self-esteem among young people so that tomorrow they'll be able to take major decisions in their lives. Youths Decide has created many applications. WeCodeLand is a website that helps young entrepreneurs set up their own digital businesses. And Shayani offers ride-sharing services that is expanding in Tunisia. The country has limited natural resources. Wala and her team's biggest hope is to use digital technology to improve Tunisia's economy. Six years ago, thousands of people took to this square denouncing authoritarian rule and calling for a better life. Now, people still believe the country's political elite has turned its back on those who brave the streets and risk their lives for the sake of democracy. Hashbah Barra, Al Jazeera, Tunis.